but it is really deserted considering. I think they maybe ha needed to have a bit of a rethink of that one. I'm not sure. We most of the people have moved off sanctuary. Yeah, I would imagine they have. But I'm surprised they didn't build anything before they left. You know, it's like they've they've done like a really bare minimum before they've moved. Do you think it's that they just find a new place to go and then they just they can't obviously pull up their sanctuary claim, but they can just they just go off and uh, and do other things elsewhere and they pull up all of their buildings. Is that what happens? You can pull up because of your sanctuary claim. Oh, okay. I thought it said that once you put it down, you couldn't. But I, I there's a lot of information coming at my head right now, so I could have got that wrong. Not the territory unit. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, the territory unit, you can pull up probably about just about everything else. So they probably pulled up every other bit of their claim. You can move your base. Yeah, that's really cool. But you'd need to have um, enough mats to make another like claim tile to go elsewhere. You get well, you get your one freebie, and then you got to build one. And they were saying it was quite expensive, but what quite expensive really means is maybe slightly uh, subjective. Yeah, doing the bare minimum and advancing as fast as they can. Yeah, that's probably a bit of that as well. But I'm gonna obviously because I'm learning. I'm probably gonna spend a bit of time just um, just building on Sanctuary Moon until I'm a bit more confident with what I'm doing. About halfway there now. Oh, thanks, Scout One. It's nice to have someone in here that's actually played the game a little bit because a lot of people haven't even heard of this yet. It's um, it seems to be very very early on in its in its sort of life at the moment. But I think it's a really promising concept. Played since beta. Did you play anything else before? You, have you come from sort of an Eve community, an Empyrean community, like a Vorian, anything along those lines? Elite Dangerous. Oh, cool. I haven't played that one. Yeah, it's, it's really early on as well, Amaton, so it's going to be a lot of improvements. I think the graphics are going to get a big upgrade, probably, as well. Um, but it sounds, it seems like there's a lot to it, and, like, I just spent so much of my life on EVE. I was a, what you call a long trader. I, I was a... I would do um, long range, I skilled up in long range marketing and I basically had, I would buy anything within 40 jumps of, um, oh where were we, of the system I was in. Um, I forget where I was. But anyway, I, I would just buy anything within in 40 jumps then put it up for a profit margin and then just wait for it to sell. I was so lazy. <laughs> I didn't do any hauling or anything with the risk. Whoa! That's why no one's in this tile. Um, oh, they've mined the absolute bejesus out of this. That's why, that's why it's so difficult to traverse. Um, but yeah, then I would just wait for the profit to roll in, and honestly, I was I was trading. I think I was on to battleships. I was trading battleships with quite a uh, quite a good profit margin. Sounds like I'd enjoy Elite Dangerous. Oh, okay. Well, I could um, I could maybe grab a key for it because I do. Um, I could ask uh, my contacts. The Frontier, who does all the Planet Zoo stuff to put me onto a, someone from Elite. Definitely. Let's see if I get a key or something. Hugged a black coal. It happens a lot in Elite today. <laughs> Hmm. 
Oh, ATITD. That's a brilliant game. I played that years ago. Years ago with Avak. What telling are they on now? Like 42. <laughs> It's instantly getting very jank because we're coming into like a main hub here, so need to go a little slower maybe. Okay, I think this is the market. I don't know whether we need to sort of... Everyone's parked near all the ramps, so now I can't get up the ramp. I don't know. I, I may have to just jump out here. Alright. Why do I look green? Oh, I, my suit's purple, isn't that green? When is my suit green? Is there a green light or something around here? I've actually talked a bit about the trade empire here. Yeah. Although by the time we played, I think it was quite a way through the telling. So we were like trying to build all these like posts and you have to build one higher than the person before you. And we had to put loads of materials into our house because we were so late into the telling. Chromite dust reacted with the atmosphere, and I turned green. I don't want to be green. Who said I could be green? Boo. I should put my tool away. Still green. Still boo. Then we're going to market to sell all the beautiful ores. If I can find the door, that would help. Oh, cool. So we've got loads of marketplace uh, things here. Activate that. All right, we're in. Okay. We do not want nitrogen JJJ. So I'm looking to sell. Now, I'm going to say that I know enough about EVE trading that I might be able to just wing it with the tutorial for the, <laughs> for the market trading. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. My market container. Okay, so I've got natron, I've got coal, I've got bauxite, I've got aged grey pattern aluminium. I think that is, these ones are probably not just, they're probably sort of uh, processed ores and I don't want to sell those. I probably want to more sell the litres and litres of quartz and things. It's interesting how it does it in just litres of ore, rather than saying you've got a hundred ores or something like that. That's pretty cool. It's not easy being green, it's much easier being purple, that's, that's quite right, as Kermit the Frog said. So. I can instant sell or I can create a sell order. Um, well, it said go to a market. I'm at a market. So, I'm just going to have a quick look at the chat log and just make sure I'm doing it right. Okay. Um, Right, for now, I am going to instant sell, just because it's the tutorial still. And it might get a little bit janky with me if I put up, um, if I get ahead of myself and I put up market orders. That's what I, I would never, ever, ever under normal circumstances do this, okay? Nano pack upgrade is now mastered at level 2, wonderful.
So yeah, it definitely seems like if you just want to sell something that you've got right on you at the time, sell it from your market container. And I'm just going to instant sell these. And hopefully it should get me some money. So where's my money? My balance is 200,000 H. So I can instant sell that quantity. 60,000 or whatever, blah, blah, blah. Current balance, my total would be like millions i don't really get the currency quite yet on this one is it like labor hours that we're we're i don't know but let's just sell it the server failed mm. the quantity defaults to a bugged number the currency is just called quanta thank you So if I just say to sell 60, would that just sell the right amount for me? Well, it went away and I got 33 of something or other. Why would it do that? That's very, that must be an early access thing. It should just either start at zero or start at whatever you've got in your inventory. Or is it matching, like, I don't know, how many are on the marketplace total or something random? I'm not sure. Dog diving dog mom, back in a while, I'll have to take your son to work. Oh, okay, cool. Um, I'm sure by then we'll probably still be doing tutorial-y stuff, and maybe we'll have started building by then, you never know. It seems to be bringing up this error message, but it seems to also still be giving me money and also selling the things that I need to sell. So that seems fine. I am slightly worried. The only thing that I am slightly worried about is that... Um, And this is a worry, is that it doesn't seem to have noticed that I've gotten to the market. Like normally when I go somewhere. Maybe if I just walk around a bit more, I don't know. Maybe it wants me to go down below somewhere, maybe. I... Can I get in here? No, I don't have permission to go in there. Ah, in here? I'm thinking that maybe I need to just... Head down to where the actual waypoint is. way down further. Xenon's ships for sale. Okay, that might not be wise. I was talking about bringing up my map. Yeah, because it gave me a waypoint to head for. I have headed for but I haven't actually sort of completely gone to the waypoint and it might be causing me issues I'm gonna jump down here now head for a there we are and <laughs> see your harvested ore if you are not quite sure how to use the market to sell Remember you can go to the market tutorials that are accessible inside the market building. I'll put a waypoint for you if you need to find them. Seems fine. So that was that was what I needed to do. I needed to find the exact right place. That it was sort of bugging me a little bit. Um so 
Now I'm selling the harvested ore. What I didn't want to do was sell all the ore before it realized I was even in the marketplace because then I'd have to go back and get more ore and come all the way back here, which would have been a nightmare. So I'm glad I went with my gut there. Because we've still got some things that we can instant sell. I will let you finish with your selling, but when you are done, exit the market pod interface and find the dispenser that I have highlighted, marked with a waypoint, and activate it. It should be on the same floor or the floor just above or below. This dispenser is going to grant you a large amount of concrete voxel material at a super low price, which will come handy soon, as you are going to start to build your home. Oh, okay. Building is coming up soon. Yay, let's get loads of concrete. All right, so I've done my selling. I've got a couple of hundred thousand and it wants me to go to this waypoint up here. So I think we need to go up a floor by the looks of it. If I can find a little um, elevator or something, that'd be quite handy or a ramp or something. Elevator, ramp, way up. You can go into the middle here by the looks of it. Maybe that's a way up. Get up this way. Aha! There's the elevator. Nice. Pachunk! I think we're on the right level now. Here we are. So here is the concrete dispenser. It actually seems to be a little bit more... Um, a little bit sort of less janky with the movement if the faster I'm going so if I'm sprinting it seems a little bit more smoother okay so get a batch of concrete excellent this is a start but you will need more elements before you are ready to build your house open a market pot again we are going to go shopping going shopping what so all the market pods are downstairs, I think, and there's some in here. Oh yes, there is one in here. Cool. There are many, many market Great. pods here. I'm going to display a list of must have components for you to buy, displayed on the left. Go ahead and search for each component and buy them. Don't hesitate to buy more things, like decorative elements to furnish the interior. You don't have to buy everything from this list, the only mandatory component is the core unit. If you don't have enough money, try to sell more harvested ore and possibly get back to your tile to harvest more. Okay, that's a thing we can do. So we need static core unit times five. I'll try and get all of the things. Static core unit times five, local instant buy. I need these straight away. I can't be affording to get market orders for them at the moment because it's still tutorial time. Take your time to finish buying what you want from the list. If you have lost the list, it's in the hint window. You can look it up. Once this no. is done, go collect your items from the market Fuck container it. into your inventory. Oh, S, sliding door, small sliding door. At least one unit. Okay, one is fine. For now, anyway. One small window. Window. Wando? Wow. What's a wando? Window S instant buy. This is very expensive compared to what I made in Oz. I think a container would be very useful. Container. Container S. Surrogate VR station. Uh, 
them. And then decorative units as needed. Right, let's have a little look then, shall we? What kind of um, decorative parts do we have? Furniture and appliances, industry and infrastructure, planet elements, systems, transportation elements. Let's, let's give me a bed, if there's beds at all. Uh, displays, doors, lights. Lights might be quite nice. What kind of lights do we have? Headlight, phone light, square light, vertical light. How much for a square light? Can't do a local instant buy on that, okay. Interesting. You think I accidentally did a sell order for the sliding door? Oh, I'll check and make sure I've got it in my uh, inventory in just a second. Um, is there any like chairs, decorative? Furniture, dresses, wardrobes. Why is there no beds? Bathroom, area, antenna, board, decorative table, furniture, high tech furniture. Yeah, it's probably expensive. I'm not I'm not seeing any beds in here. Adjuncts, let's have a look. Wings. The bathrooms don't have toilets either. No toilets, no beds. You're not allowed to go to the toilet or sleep in this game. That's the rules now. And yeah, you got dresses and nightstands and all sorts. High tech furniture, force fields and virtual projectors. Wow. Sounds like there's all sorts of cool stuff. Systems. And they're all things for your your battle. For for your, for your battleship. I wish that was not in the way of the marketplace. That's very annoying. So I need to collect them from the market container. Okay. Well, let's just come out of here. Oh, no, I don't want to exit the market while they're still in the market container. Right. So now. Maybe in holograms. Virtual bed. No sleeping or toilets? How does that work? I don't know. I didn't make the game. So this is the market container and this is my nano pack. Um, so we did have the sliding door. We've got all five things that we need to make a very, very basic place. And then I can always come back here once I've got more of an idea what my place looks like and buy a few things for it. Once you will be done with transferring your acquisitions, I encourage you to visit the Construction Institute and the Building Tutorial if you have not yet done so, since I you will need this skill for the next step. I've as much as I skipped the market it, tutorial. Case. After this, simply open the map to find your tile, colored in green, and head back to your territory for the next step. First, I've got to find my speedster, colored in whatever. 
I probably should have done the whole thing where you uh, make where you bundle up the speeder. Because I don't know where it is now. <laughs> and that's unfortunate. But there's some lovely like stuff you can do with the buildings. So I'm very much looking forward to giving that a go. Exit. Okay, so let's just go down here. And my speedster is somewhere amongst all these ships. I probably really should have... Um, oh, it was at the bottom of the ramp. Or one of the ramps. So if I just go down to the bottom of a ramp... I think I am going to bundle it up, though. There's loads of people that have just left their massive ships down here. This is just like the ship parking. They should put like a, a proper parking lot in these places. That's such a missed opportunity. Everyone's just parked underneath the station. Lots of players have just abandoned their ships. Poor ships! Where's my ship then? There's going to be so many identical ones to mine. Is this my one? Oh yeah, that's Baby Driver. Okay, so Baby Driver, I want you to um, compact down. Because I'm off to do a building tutorial. So that just compacted itself into my inventory and I can deploy it later. Nice. I was a bit worried about that. I'm just going to press um, S5. Uh, Oh, escape to close. Okay, let's get rid of that little bit. I don't need that. I am off to do building. Building tutorial, and then we'll go back home and we'll start doing some actual building. But I don't trust myself to start on the building until then. So we need to go to the shuttle, I think, and go back to the uh, to the hub, I think. And that's where we do the tutorials, isn't it? I think. But then, where is the where is the shuttle? Need the shuttle. There's some blinking cool ships, so it's really nice. Zenon's ships for sale. Oh wow, of course, cool. like a ship shop. <laughs> the ship shop. <laughs> yeah, I can double tap to go really fast too. Whee! But that's no good if I don't know where I'm going. So let's say if, if there's anything on the map about like... Um, Planet system space, okay. <clears throat> I, I would be sure that the shuttle would be down here somewhere. But there's so many ships around that I can't find it. A UEF store. Oh, this is good. Oh, I see, they've built that quite close. I feel rather silly at the moment, though. I feel rather silly that I can't find the shuttle. Is this it over here? Aha! Found it, I think. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so I want to go back and do the... Uh, I want to go back and do the tutorial on building so that I'm not completely at a loss when I do my building. I do want to do a little base building today, definitely. I've only been going for two hours, so we've got quite a long time still to get a, a reasonable building going, I would say, um, in this stream.
So we do have look. It does. It did say it was like quite seamless and didn't have loading screens, but it does have them between Sanctuary Moon and and Alioth. I assume that's because it's taking you from like an uninstanced area to like instanced areas or something. You come and help build if you need. If I need another pair of hands later. Well, you said you were going to bed, didn't you, Scout One? If you want to come and uh, and help out, then that's absolutely fine by me. But uh, I wouldn't like to deprive you of any sleep. Okay, so we're back here now. Now. Showed me where the tutorial room was. Do I remember it? So this is the instancing room. That was the room. This is the room over here that takes me to institutes. Ah, this is the one I want. Then I want to go to the building institute. Uh, 